voice speech recognition. You can now have a voice do fun stuff with, like for example, read out the donation message. You can simply go to the configuration tab and click on the cog next to the status and scroll down. You might have noticed an option called speech voice selection. If you have Windows 7 or older, this will only be Microsoft Anna. If you have Windows 8.1 or higher, there are two other defaults to choose from. You can also add voices simply by going to the Voice Attack website. I will add this particular link in the description down below. I must however warn you that this means that you're going to have to be manually editing in your registry. So neither the bot nor these, these, this poster of this forum is responsible and it's completely at your own risk. Once you are done with that, you can simply click one of the voices that you want to add and then choose the speed rate you want it on as well as the speech volume. If you then go to the donation notification, you will notice that underneath the sound donor as well as the top donor, there is a speech text. In it, you can pretty much use any command, but at the, at the add message add command is the one that tells you what the message of the donation is. If you select preview, then you might have noticed that the sound donor as well as the speech text is simultaneously. However, this is not the case after you save it. Deepbot then recognizes the length of the sound donor as, and after that the speech text will enable. So these two are not simultaneously when you're getting a donation. This concludes this tutorial.